since we went live this early in the morning. So Or on a Sunday. Or on a Sunday. It's been a while. It has been a while. So we are here today. I'm super, super excited. Um, one of our Wi-Fi providers are down again. So it's such a blessing that we have two internet providers to just switch through when one's down because they are down literally all of the time. They are very unreliable. Very unreliable. So we just pay for two. Um, so it's really, really awesome. In today's video, we are going to make a really fun Alexa um, do the dishes towel, which is so adorable that you are going to love being able to see how we make this. And that's the first time I've been able to say it. I think I was saying it so fast that you know who couldn't hear it because we have a you know who here in the craft room and she's been talking to us a lot when we've been talking about this project so as you guys tune in share with me where you're visiting from let us know what you've got going on in your neck of the woods we hope that you all are having a fantastic sunday morning what a great time to be here getting crafty yes i have been um scrambling to pack because right after this i have got to head to the airport um i took a shower this morning which i didn't even think i would have time to do but i just had to make time for it to help boost my energy. Do you ever have those moments, Rachel? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so what's everyone saying? They're saying good morning, hello from where they're from. Oh, we've got Arizona, Michigan, South Carolina, Hi. Florida, um, New Jersey, Nebraska. We got people from everywhere. And How today, fun. guys, we're happy to report it has stopped raining. Yeah, the the sun is out. shining. Mm -hmm. It is like 55 right now, but this wind is being a killer. But oh we have to take what we get. It's one thing, it's another, um, and that's, never so much truer so in today's video we are using our adorable fonts for all of our year members to create this alexa do the dishes towel um, which i think is so adorable you guys are going to love making this and putting it um, in your kitchen we have so many awesome projects going on um, that you all are just bound to enjoy this quick and simple uh, little towel I just I just love it. Things like that is something that you probably couldn't find in every store. So being able to make it is a lot, a lot of fun. Yeah, and you get to pick your own towel, pick your own colors. It's, it's one of those products that's super customizable. Yeah, and this is a pretty textured towel. So I love giving you an example of how well the iron-on does with it. Um, it is very durable. So you all are going to really enjoy that aspect. And again, guys, we still have 20% off the membership. So the fonts are for year members only. Um, so if you're a monthly member and you're like, yes, I want access to all of these 80 plus fonts. Um, how do I get that? Be sure to use the link below, get your year membership, and then we'll be able to um, give you that 20%. So super, super fun. How is everyone doing? Any fun comments of what people's got going on on this Sunday? Everybody's doing good from what I can Yay. see here. Um, we have one viewer saying, I'm going back and forth on uh, the idea of getting a, getting a heat press or a Cricut Easy Press. What are your yes. thoughts? Oh my gosh, I love my Easy Press. And for any personal use, as you're going to see here in today's video, we are huge fans of the Easy Press. I mean, they're just so perfect. The 9x9 Easy Press is a great deal. And for your like, like, storage I don't know how much room you have but the um, easy press stores really well and it gives excellent results um, way better than an iron but um, not as much room or hassle as a heat press so yeah and we do have a couple questions about the summit and where can they go to get some answers to yeah those well what are they we'll take a few seconds to answer a few um some people <clears> are <throat> saying they still have not gotten the list of supplies and some other people yes. just want to know where to go because they don't seem to be getting answers anywhere else so they just awesome want... so you can send all of your customer support inquiries to hi at makers gonna learn dot com we can eat personally email you that list but we are sending out that group email and it's still not been resolved. So if you haven't got that link, go over to the member only Facebook group. What I'll do right now is go ahead and pin it to the top post. So as soon as you go over there, it should be like marked as an announcement. Yeah, I'll do I'll that, that now. Really help some people. That way you guys can download it and um, be accessing all of the supplies to get that underway. So let me find it right here. I'm going to mark that as an announcement. So you will be able to see it right up at the top. So let me show um, right here. I just marked it as an announcement. So let's see if it'll move it to the top. 
do, 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 do. let me exit and re-enter. Um, and if you click view announcements, so right here under announcements, there's a few. So if we just click see all, you can see this one right here is our 2019 spring virtual summit supply list. Um, we will be able to send that out. It's just for some reason, it only was able to be sent out to like 50 of you. So we've got a couple hundred more that we need to um, get that to. For whatever reason, our email provider is being a little janky. Um, so anywho, we are going to be able to um, click this right here and get access to all of the amazingness um, of each class. So if you've not already got your ticket to the summit, grab your t summit ticket. Um, the link's on the dashboard, and you can see here each class is highlighted and the details. So there's a lot of links because this is going to be like everything. So like I said, pick your favorites, do what you want. Um, there's lots of details for a lot of these classes. The um, doormat class has lots of details because it's going to be a very intensive class. I do just want to say that right out of the gate because making this project, you do not want to do anything wrong. So like for the doormat class, I'm going to say if you're really excited to make some doormats this spring and you want to do it the right way, the best way, follow her supplies because that class is going to be really great. Um, Rachel went super in depth with her summer home decor class with each project. And as you can see here, in a whole hour class, Rachel is going to be creating three different projects with you. So maybe you're like, I don't want to make a dip dyed pillow during the summit, but what type of summer projects do I want to make during this class? Rachel's teaching how to make some um, farmhouse wall decor, dip dyed spring pillows, and then she's making a felt leaf wreath. So you're getting tons of value and tons of training. Um, Courtney is making a beach bag, like sewing together a beach bag for you sewist. It's gonna be amazing. And then using a die cutting machine and iron on vinyl. Then she's gonna be teaching a pillows 101 class comparing all different types of pillows you can create. So that's a great um, class. And then lots of awesome graduation gifts. And then I'm teaching, I totally skipped it for some reason. We're going to be, we have Crystal Thompson who made that awesome video on the channel that you guys seem to love doing. She's making three, two or three different cards. I think two um, in her card making class with the Cricut. Everyone loves her cards. I love her They're cards. Beautiful. And then our wooden sign masterclass. These supplies, we're going to talk about a lot of different wood options, um, but we'll have some wood samples there. I'll, if you all are interested, I can link you to some like wood options from Home Depot, but really it's thin pieces of plywood and then one by four pieces of wood. And then we're going to be talking about a few different size frames. So my tip is to know if you want to make a 16 by 12 frame, make sure you have a 16 by 12 piece of wood and the um, assortment of one by four pieces as well. So we're going to use an air nailer or a drill. And then if you're using an air nailer, make sure you have nails for said air nailer. And then if you're using a drill, make sure you have some screws. So seriously, we've put so much into the supply list. If you feel overwhelmed, totally understand. Um, we want that to be here. Super excited. Um, I can let you all know the first 50 people that purchased a ticket got the mystery box supplies those will be being sent out the like by the middle of this upcoming week tuesday or wednesday so you should be getting those boxes at the latest this next monday um so a week from tomorrow is the latest but a lot of people will probably be getting those later on at the end of this week so that's super exciting um we can send out an email to those 50 but i do want to say if you got in at our if you're a returning summit member from the fall summit, you are for sure confirmed a mystery box um, because that was for sure. So the ones returning that got in when, as soon as the fall summit ended and you took advantage of that special offer, um, you got one for sure. If you, where it gets tricky is when we had that pre-sale right before I went to Mexico, there's a small portion of you guys that got one to hit that 50 boxes. So 
Um, like I said, there's 50 and we're going to be changing it up so that everyone that wants a mystery box can get one for next year's fall summit. And I'm going to let you all already know that it is a two week, um, we're going to have like a two week campaign to get your ticket. If you want a ticket to the fall summit and you know, you want a mystery box supply and we've invested a lot of money into the boxes this year. So I'm super excited, um, for the ones that get that, but, um, we weren't able to give one to everyone just because last time, Rachel, do you know how many boxes we sent out last time? There was like, it was a so ton. many, there were so many. Um, so we had to shift it a little bit for this one, but now we're ready to be able to do even more. We've mastered it. Yeah. Um, and we want to <clears> do <throat> quality over quantity as well. You know, we want to give you yeah. guys some awesome stuff. And if, you know, if we broaden that out for everybody, we would have to lower the quality a little. So right. we just want to keep it small so yeah. we can give you all, you know, exactly what we want to give you all. Definitely. And for the 50 that's getting mystery boxes, just to pump you guys up a little, um, we're giving you, I'm pretty sure, a entire roll of iron on an entire roll of vinyl. I'm pretty sure that I was able to confirm both of those. So you're getting a ton of supplies for some of these classes and we'll be letting you guys know more about that. So great questions. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will tr email those 50 to let you guys know who got those. Um, so yeah, any other questions about the summit? So sorry for the ones that are like, I just wanna make a craft. <laughs> well, not about the summit, but we do get this question at least once a live stream. Of course. And that <clears throat> is, what is the difference between your membership versus Cricut Access? Oh, do I need both? Um, that's a great question. Yes, you do need both um, if you love Cricut Access and you think you would love everything we have to offer. Um, what we, the biggest difference between the two memberships, I would say, is that Cricut gives you access to 70,000 art pieces of artwork. So we're not trying to compete necessarily with them when it comes to artwork, but what we really feel like we do really well is giving you the training, the one-on-one, -on -one, um, the inspiration and the motivation to use your machine in a lot of different ways. So we have printable guides that we absolutely adore and love for our crafting. Um, it's perfect to have on the craft table. We give you guys access to our free commercial license. So you're able to use all of our artwork. We have over like 700 different files you're able to use that are 100% hand lettered and you get instant access to everything we're talking about as soon as you join, which is awesome. And after that, you get 80 plus fonts with another 80 coming out every quarter, which is wonderful. And you get access, if you're a year member, to fonts as well as, oh no. Our powers. Oh my gosh, but our backup, our backup didn't our go backup's out. Our backup's not letting it go out. This is crazy. We put we a backup. We can thank Joseph for this again. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. We put a backup. Look, she working. Oh my gosh. She's like, I'll get, I got you. This is crazy. I hear it clicking on. I do too. Okay. Um, but you also get bonus training courses on how to use your machine and all that great stuff. I told you that the wind, the wind, the wind's is not crazy. Us out. This is not good. Oh no. This well, guys, if we just cut out, it's because <laughs> we lost all. This hope. wind is literally crazy. It's like twenty cents a miles an hour. This oh my morning. gosh. Okay, I need to get out of here. Okay, any other questions? <laughs> no, there's no more questions. Awesome. Well, thanks, guys. Um, I'm going to be able to reply to through all of um these questions on the supply list. I was very busy yesterday afternoon, still working on my home office. So we'll get you handled. And it's looking handled. good, guys. You all are gonna love it. We'll get you guys handled for the summit this week. Um, I think the supply list, I had no idea how excited people would be for the supply list. So again, I'm so sorry. I'm going to honestly let you all know for the fall summit, as soon as the spring summit ends, I'm getting the class schedule finalized for the fall summit. So guess what? We're gonna be giving you guys supply lists like four months ahead of time. <laughs> yeah, because you can get extra, extra, extra prepared. planning, everything like that, um, because I think that's one thing that we lack. So again, I just wanna to apologize to you guys for not being like super on top of it, that we can just do that for the fall summit, because it's not hard to be able to do that. So anyway, who is ready to get crafty? Me. We're gonna be talking through this whole project using the fonts. Thanks guys for bearing with us as we answered all of those awesome questions. You all are troopers. So <clears throat> here we go. We're on the dashboard of makersgonnalearn.com. This is where you get access to all of our cut files, our fonts, all the goodness um, right here on the site. 
So what we're going to do is we're going to click on that font dashboard. Now remember the font dashboard is available to year members only. So if you're thinking about getting a membership with the 20% off offer, feel free to take advantage of that 20% off um, because you definitely will want to take advantage of that. And then you can just scroll on down and we're going to find this tater tot font. Let's see here. Rachel, if I if you if I miss it, be looking with me. I don't think you're gonna miss it. I think it's either like blue or purple, maybe, mm -hmm. it, or red. I can't. But it's it's closer <laughs> it's to blue, the bottom. Blue, purple, red, green, yellow. It's closer to the bottom. There's so many fonts. There are so many fonts. Okay. It's a super cute one. It's adorable. Tater tots. It's pink. Okay. Look at this one. So we're just gonna click on that font and it's gonna open up. And again, guys, if for some reason you did not get your summit ticket and you're like, I want to come to the two-day virtual crafting summit, the link to say $50 is on your dashboard. And this is a great thing. If you've ever had this pop up, um, totally normal, you just have to click sign in. And then you can click right here. I have auto login. Which is so handy. So handy. Two-step button. And then look, we're on our site. We're getting what we need. All that good stuff. I cannot believe it. Send us right back to the homepage. That's annoying. Um, but we're going to find Tater Tot. Did I miss it? No. Nope. You're getting close. There, there she is. is. We Beautiful. found her. So you just click on the fonts and it will download. Remember, the same process is the same on desktop and um, laptop as well as iPad. But with iPad, you must have this app called Any Font and it's um, one. 99 but remember if you're using your laptop desktop you do not need any additional pieces of software so in any font you just click on tater tots install that bad boy we're gonna click allow and then for some reason if this ever happens to you happens to me a bunch we're just gonna want to go back to any font and click on it again and watch what happens this is what's supposed to happen sometimes I have to do this twice it's kind of odd now it's always supposed to pop up right so you want it to pop up you want to click install i'm going to enter in my password no looky we don't need Taylor's privacy it's gone <laughs> it's nothing important but we're just going to click install and so it's that easy honestly guys i don't even read all the pages i just click allow agree yes done <laughs> exactly so super super fun are there any questions about yeah, that process or anything not the process but we have a, a viewer asking when's the next sale for signing up it's going on right now You're you in can the midst take of advantage of 20 percent off right now so i'm going to drop you that link because you guys are wanting to take advantage of that we want you to take advantage of that so just click right there that link and take advantage of 20 percent off how awesome is that super super fun um and it's awesome. So, and y'all have four days to take advantage. Yes, of that. it ends on the last day of the month, which is the twenty eighth of this month, because it's February. So we're gonna click new project, and we're gonna replace yesterday's project, and we are just gonna open up the text, and click on systems, and we're gonna type in Tater Tots, and we're just gonna type out Alexa, comma, do. Did you do yours in all capital? Look over there to your... Yeah, I think you did. You did, you did, you did. I'm I mean, do it's personal preference. It's to totally do it all personal capital preference. Or but I love doing lower. things in all capital. We, yeah. lo we love our Alexa. We do, we do, we do. I don't want to say it too loud or she'll be like, what? Yeah, she'll be like, hey. Okay, <clears throat> so now what we're going to do is I'm going to click actions and I'm going to click, excuse me, edit. And I'm going to click align and I'm just going to align text center. And sometimes this happens. It's because of spaces. So this looks all odd. So if you click on it, um, you move your cursor around. Sometimes you got to take out these extra spaces. And um, uh, Christina says, one of my favorite things about tater tots is how my two-year-old says it. That's Aww. funny. I love hearing little babies try and say stuff. That's adorable. 
I'm gonna bring letter text together just a tad bit and then line space together just a little bit. Not too much because I like the spacing. And Patty missed it. She said, what font did you use? We are <gasps> tater using tater tots. tots. Yes, tater tots. You'll love this font. So easy, so fun. Um, and it's a really awesome, simple, simple little font. And it's fun to play with, fun to have a lot of crafts with and things like that. Now for this one, again, guys, it's pretty easy. Like you don't have to weld anything because what happens when you click make it is that it's already formatted exactly how we need it. Yeah. So we're just gonna now size it. So you just kind of take your towel um, and we take our handy dandy tape measure. Yeah, and, and here I like stick. to say, it's always good to measure your towel exactly how you want it to be displayed. So like Tanner has it folded right now, that's how he's gonna hang it and display it. You right. Know? So don't measure it all unfolded because you won't know how you'd like it to be displayed. So just fold it up, then measure it. Yeah. So for ours, we're doing a four by five today, um, four inches wide and about five inches tall. I think that'll be perfect for ours. And we're just gonna be able to click make it and click replace because we changed that sizing. And then we're going to click mirror. You mirror anything that has iron on or um, you know, all the iron on needs to be mirrored because it has built in transfer tape. So you put it down shiny side. Can you see all the shiny over here on this camera? So we need the third shiny. camera. Oh, this would be so good right now. Um, but anyway, you always put it down shiny side down so that you have, you're looking at the mat because that's the actual iron on. So you just mirror it all good, all well in the world. And then what you're gonna do is just click continue it's going to hopefully let us connect to the maker. Let's see if it's, it's already connected. Um, so that's a lot of fun. I uh, like that it changes colors when it's connected to Bluetooth. Me too. That's just a super handy little cue. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Hannah, hey, Hannah wants to know what happens when we actually ask Alexa this question. Oh, let's do it. Hey, Alexa, do the dishes. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. Alexa, do the dishes. Yeah, that's what she said yesterday. Cleaning we the dishes about. is something I cannot help with, is what she said. Mm -hmm. Rude. Rude. So we're just going to turn fast mode on. Give we've, her more we've pressure. Gave more pressure. We've selected iron on. And we're going to press that flashing cricket button. Now, I've been getting a few comments about more pressure recently, um, about when I should use it, if I should use it, why do you guys use it. I thought the machine already knows. Um, the reason why we use it is because it's kind of nice to have the machine give that extra pressure because in our experience it's helped us weed so it's really like helps us just simplify the weeding process quicken it things like that and again it's personal preference like we don't use it too much on like light cardstock we don't use it on vellum there's a lot of things that you do not need to use more pressure on right. but i do have to say it's a lot about figuring it out for what you want to use it for you know what i mean like You've got to figure it out and see what's best for your crafting and your iron on and your vinyl um, and your machine. Like Rachel and I put in a new blade and oh my gosh, we used more pressure and it cut through the, the yeah, transfer. Yeah, I was about to say, I think that also more pressure is one of those awesome things that Cricut has. And it stretches because they that know, blade Yeah, life. because they know that your blades are not going to stay sharp and perfect forever. So once they start getting just a little dull, you slap on more pressure yeah. and it's like it's a new blade. So yes. it's a really cool little tool to have. So much fun. And what's everyone doing? I see lots of emojis over there. I see well, Melissa Garcia. Hey, Melissa. Yeah, she said that when you asked your Alexa that, that her Alexa answered <laughs> in the funny. same way. That's so freaking funny. That is funny. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. And lots of people are having wind issues, wind advisories. One lady, let me see if this I can find it. This is crazy. Said, okay, Pat, she said winds here in Michigan are supposed to get up to 60 miles per hour. Oh my goodness. 60 miles an hour. I mean, you what gotta do you take do shelter. Then, Pat? Do you just like stay in your storm shelter? Like 60 miles an hour, that's destructive. Did she say she's in Michigan? Yeah, Michigan. Wonder if they have storm shelters. She said though. we're in the middle of a bomb cyclone. I don't really oh, know what no. that means. Sounds super scary. We'll be thinking about you guys up there. Yes, oh my goodness. Yes. And I'll take my 20 degree, or my 20 mile per hour yes. winds. But Tanner. Rachel. We need to preheat our baby easy press. We do need to preheat the baby easy press. It's so a we're, baby. We're going to turn it on. We're going to do 330 today. But if you guys are wanting to always know what to use, you can just open up your easy press temperature sheet chart here in the Cricut printable guide that we have for all of our beautiful members. Um, you can download this for free. 
any membership tier gets access to the guide, which we love. Print it out, enjoy it. And we're using like a cotton uh, canvas blend. I, I, I'm, it is 100% cotton, but it's like a very like stiff cotton. Yeah, and someone asked if this towel is just used for display. We're going to use it for display, but we bought it at Walmart just in the normal towel yeah. section. So you can totally use it for normal things if you choose not to iron on it. Definitely. And guys, I was watching one of mine and Rachel's old live streams and went before we had the mic for Rachel. Oh my gosh. Was I screaming or could you just no one hear me? It, it was just... It just wasn't as nice as it is nowadays. That's all I have to say. Like it oh. wasn't, it wasn't bad, but it wasn't good. Well, yeah, Tanner, we started at the bottom. Now we're here. I mean, we started with my iPhone. That's just what's so funny. And you guys were troopers for, for watching it. Honestly, honestly, honestly. They were dedicated. Dedicated to the iPhone. And guys, I'm going to visit Leah Griffith today. I'm literally about to head to the airport. So let me know what you all want us to do on our live stream tomorrow. We are shooting her class for the summit tomorrow, um, but we're also planning to do a little live stream for you guys like we always do because we love getting to hang out with you guys. So please let us know what you guys want us to make. What do you want us to talk about? Um, Leah and I have such a fun little time going live with you and hanging out with you guys. So be sure to let us know what you think we should make or talk about um, anything like that would be so much fun she is i mean the queen of paper flowers oh man don't we all know it oh gosh yeah rachel this wind i feel mm. like a tree's just go fall down and yeah. land right i was just like us. playing hopscotch over limbs as i was going to my car today oh my to gosh. get to tanner's at your house there's limbs everywhere yeah wow yeah, that big tree in front oh, it just drops no. off limbs when it's windy oh no well, we're getting our, all of our trees cut down, but I talked to the tree cutter people that were supposed to do it the last week in February. Obviously, they're about three or four weeks more behind. Yes, because, because of this weather. Never stops raining. Never all the stops rain. raining. And we then love March seeing is, your head, Tanner. What? We love seeing your head. Hey, I just washed my head, so woohoo. Anyway, um, we're just weeding this out. Do you want to scoot it to the middle? Oh, I'm not even paying attention. I'm too focused on the weeding process. That's okay. That's why I'm here. <laughs> oh. Okay, people, take a poll. Is Tanner's hair black or brown? It's black. Don't Look even Look at it. Here me. in the camera, you got a great view right now. It's black totally black. It's t Rachel, are you going to try to argue with me that it's not black? No, I mean, Who? James's is really dark brown, but I think next to you, yours is black, definitely. Has anyone ever tried to argue? Now, I will remember in kindergarten, there was a lot of debates on people's hair because we had that, like, pit, a student a week on the, like, board or whatever. Yeah. And now that started some controversy. That's when I first realized my hair was not brown. And also, when you're little, your hair's different. Like, when I was little, my hair was snow white, but now it just keeps getting darker and darker. That's pretty crazy, Rach. I That's know. That's pretty crazy. I know. Was your hair that dark when you were a baby? Yes. Oh. Uh, it's been this way. Nothing's changed. Mm -hmm. well, has anyone said anything about what me and Leah should do? Any any suggestions? Mm -hmm. What's no, everybody saying? everybody just says your hair is brown. <laughs> <laughs> There's not been a single what? black. What? Brown, dark, brown, 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 dark, brown, dark, 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 brown. Yeah. No, no. One's, no one says it's black. Can someone that's met me, Melissa Garcia, are you still here? Tell people my hair's black. Look at him with his 2020 reading these. These are tiny comments over here. He's oh, my gosh. Them. Mm -hmm. Oh, gosh. Yeah. Oh, no. David said black. David, thank you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I appreciate you. Um, okay. We're going to iron this on, and this is done. Like, this is super easy. So, we preheated this baby easy press. Now, guys, if you can only afford, or you really only need one easy press, let's be real. Um, I went a year using one easy press before they came out with all the different sizes. Um, no, we love all our sizes. We love all the different yeah. sizes. Don't get us wrong. We, we all could live with just one. Um, and the one we recommend is the 9 by 9 If you have the option and you love your Easy Press, if you're an avid crafter and you have the space to store it, get all three. We have four because we still have our first one. Anyway, all you need to do is get one that you feel is, you're comfortable with. And I think the best one is the 9 by 9 if you only want one. But we're using the baby one today, so we're just going to preheat 
this right here for like five seconds. It's the cutest thing ever. It's adorable, man. This little bitty. Before we got ours, we were would pass by in Michael's and Hobby Lobby, and I'd be like, Tanner, look. I know it's so freaking adorable. It so is. we just preheat that for like five seconds, and then you lay it down. Some firm pressure. Firm pressure. Yeah, look at Tanner giving that pressure. <laughs> we have our mini easy press mat, which we adore as well. Rachel loves all tiny things, so of course she appreciates this. Of course, of course. Melissa Garcia says she has seven easy presses. Okay. Talk about a stash. <laughs> Melissa, what are you doing? How? What do you do with your easy presses? She's so just, sweet. Yeah, you have an easy press for every day of the week. <laughs> That's funny. She does. Okay. You get crafty every day. <laughs> I love that. So we're gonna let this cool for a few moments. And then just peel this back. You can kind of see um, that it's not completely set. So we're gonna hit this just one more time. And I'm gonna let this cool a little bit more than we just did. So since it's cotton, you kind of want to do it a little bit cooler. And we don't talk about this suit a lot, but where can all of our amazing members go to give their, their um, opinions on cut files or font ideas or anything yeah. like that? Um, so first of all, I'm hitting the back of the project just for like 15 seconds. And that is a great question. So what I would recommend, we have Facebook threads. So search like suggestions or things like that um, on the Facebook group. There are like two or three threads that we monitor, that we were like, hey, suggestions. Um, I do let you guys know that we like do calls for suggestions because we plan out our artwork like six months at least in advance to work with the artist on development. So we're already planned out for like the next six months and so. But if you guys have suggestions that you're like, oh my gosh, this would be the best idea ever, find that thread, leave it there, send us an email, we kind of keep up with it there too so that when we're ready to plan out new collections, new artwork, new fonts, um, we have them. We would love right now, I can let you guys know, we need font suggestions. So let us know if there's any fonts that you guys love that you're like, ooh, what would it be if we had more of these type of fonts and things like that. Yeah, we do have, and that's what we're mostly getting is some font suggestions. They're wanting to see some dog fonts, some Harry Potter fonts, some things like that. And we love all that whimsical stuff. So please yeah. let us know all your wonderful options because we do this for you all, you know? Exactly. So look at this. Where this is a very textured towel, it looks like it's not stuck down. But once you start peeling it, look at how awesome And this is. right here is one of those projects like Tanner's doing that you want to peel off warm. Yes. If it gets too cool, you do run the risk of peeling that up. Yeah, but look at how awesome this is. Super fun project. And we had a question of uh, where we got these. These came in like a five pack from Ooh. Walmart. It had this white color, gray and blue. So how stinking adorable. We both have one Alexa do the dishes towel, which we love. So much fun and super easy to make. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear this. Oh my god. Scrub dishes underwater? Oh wow. Oh. Thank you. Alexa. Thank you, WikiHow. Alexa, stop. Well, now we all know how to wash dishes. Wow. I hope we all learned something. Wow. I hope they could hear that. Did you? Could you all hear that? I think so. Good. Um, because Alexa just schooled us on how to wash dishes. We've been doing it wrong. Yeah. Uh, scrub them underwater? What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Under running water, please. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that... they could hear Yay! it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, well, Pat said Alexa needs a mic. <laughs> True. She That's does. So funny. Oh my gosh, guys. Well, it is this easy to make your very own Alexa do the dishes towel. Dang it, I said it again. Um, so much fun uh, that we love, <laughs> but really easy. We loved using the font Tater Tot for this project. Again, guys, if you have not been able to take advantage of 20% off, use the link that we just popped up in the chat um, and grab your, your membership so that you get access to 
80 plus fonts, 80 more coming out in April, $150 worth of e-courses. You get our free commercial license. You get access to over 700 digital cut files today with new ones coming out every single month. With that year membership, you get 20% off, which is wonderful, um, which is a huge savings. And then you get grandfathered in for that rate. And if you guys love what we do here on the YouTube channel, you're going to absolutely adore the membership and everything like that. Um, so much fun. Thank you guys for working with us on the summit. We're super excited to be hosting you guys very soon. Just one more weekend until the summit. So two weeks, like two weeks until the summit, almost like 13 days now or 12 days. Yep. Something like something that. Something like that. 13 days until the summit. It's not Monday. I thought today was Monday. That's funny. Um, it's Sunday. So 13 days until the summit. So much fun. We have lots of things packed in for you guys. So if you have not already grabbed your ticket and you are a member, the link is on your dashboard. So be sure to use that link to save um, $50 on that registration because being a member is amazing and we want to give you all the savings possible and fun stuff like that. So are there any other questions? Yes, we have two. Um, okay. Do monthly members get the commercial license? Mm -hmm. And, oh, where was it? Mm, oh, yeah. We had a viewer that says, I saw the supply list for the summit and now I'm a little intimidated. Maybe I'm too new for the summit. Nope. I don't believe that. Nope. You are totally fine. Don't let your mind play tricks on you. <laughs> I'm telling you, if you were watching earlier, if you tuned in late, it's okay. I was just going over the summit supply list. It is overwhelming. It's overwhelming to anyone because it's just a list of supplies. You guys don't know what you're doing yet. Um, and that's totally normal. Pick your favorite classes, get supplies and really focus in on those. You're getting these classes forever. They walk you through step by step each process and step a lot easier than any other YouTube video on making, say, a doormat or a paper crafting card. Um, so you're getting all of the um, support and steps very easily and able to consume yeah. it. Don't let the supply list yeah, overwhelm don't. you. We just want to set you all up for success and give you every single item we use for them. Yeah. But pick and choose on your own pace exactly what you want to create. Mm -hmm. That If you have a ticket, then these classes are yours forever. Ever. You can watch them as many forever. times as you'd like. I promise you will not be sorry about yeah. having this You're going to have ticket. a lot of fun. You'll enjoy you're it. You're going to learn so much. And just already having that weekend carved out, if you're able to be there and just be present crafting, it's such a great excuse to kind of have some you time. Um, I know I need it. So yeah, it's a lot, a lot of fun. Be sure to you know let us know if you have any other questions on that. And we're super, super excited to see you guys at the summit as well as I will be back here hopefully tomorrow with Leah doing a little live stream. And then well, not Rachel, here. Not but here. With Leah. But with Leah over in her offices right. in Portland. Um, Rachel will probably be back on Tuesday. Or Wednesday. Or Wednesday. Depends I know. On... Yeah, I'll be, I'll be here. I'll probably do a live stream maybe with another instructor, Jen, from Something Turquoise, which you guys adored ugh, ugh. when we did her live stream about Cricut Wedding Projects. Love, Jen. So um, be sure to get excited for that. We're going to be in LA Tuesday. I'm hopping all over the place, um, traveling for the summit and things like that. But yeah, any other last minute questions? Not that I can see. People awesome. are wishing you a safe trip. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And we'll be back here really soon sharing with you guys more videos. So talk to y'all later. Bye.